Welcome back to 5 Minute Knives, the channel that can eat its weight in turkey. Today, we're going to talk about a weird little axe sent in by a subscriber friend of mine, and some other stuff. But first, let's pay a bill. We're back. Hopefully we paid a bill. I'm actually recording this on Turkey Day. It's actually noon on Turkey Day. Lily is cooking right now. And uh, Grub's going to start coming out pretty soon within the next hour. I'm pretty damn excited. I've been starving myself. I don't know how you guys do it in your household. But I did want to talk about this axe really quick. I had this laying around from Josh Fields. If you guys remember, I believe he sent this in as part of his Crix Mix giveaway last year. It's the Matty Spax Ontario axe. It's got a little crowbar. It's got a sharpened um, point, a sharpened uh, little chisel area here. That could be pretty nasty. Of course, your axe part, my card of scales. Seen some light use, but Josh gave me this and told me to give it away and I had given away the other things that were in the box. We're down to this. It's still laying around. I have a few miscellaneous things from other people laying around in the same way. But this was laying around. Now, my friend Brad from Sharpens Best, and he does the gun shows. I always see him around. He's a vendor there. And you guys remember my Hill People Gear chest rig. And I actually keep one of Brad's carbide sharpeners in this bag. This is Brad's. This is Sharpen, Sharpens Best. Little carbide deal, yo. Give me this. I believe there's a fire starter in there too. Little bottle opener. Pretty nice. He was my neighbor at one of the shows I did. And I got to know him pretty well. And he gave me one of these sharpeners. Anyway, he's got a YouTube channel, Sharpens Best. A lot bigger than this one, by the way. And um, he was telling us at the last show that his stuff... Um, had been stolen. He always had a certain batch of knives that he would use to show people how the sharpeners work. It's a really simple setup. He's just got a table, a bunch of his knives, his sharpeners, and he sits there cutting paper all day. People buy his stuff. So, I think he was at a movie theater and somebody broke into his car and stole all his knives. And it's kind of like, you know, your cast. You know, you get to know the, the, each knife pretty well. And he was really bumming about that. So, to help him rebuild, I'm going to give him this Matty Spax axe. It's perfect for him. It's super heavy. I don't know who I would give this to anyway. I'm sure Josh would approve of helping somebody out. Josh hates thieves as much as I do. Anyway, this is for you, Brad. Um, you know, sorry you got your stuff stolen, but it's the least we can do. If you guys want to send knives in for Brad to sharpen, I'm sure he'll make a video for you, giving you a shout out and so on. You can send them to the P.O. box on the screen here, and I'll make sure he gets them. I see the guy, like, at least once or twice a month. So I'll just uh, set up a care package for him. This will be the first one to go. It's heavy. It's clunky. It's a good test of the sharpener. And he likes to sharpen weird stuff, so this will be perfect uh, for him to get his collection started again. I wanted to shout out you guys on Turkey Day. Say hello. Hopefully you're not eating yourselves to death today as I'm about to. I'm smelling food right now. I'm going crazy. But I wanted to make a quick one that was easy to edit, in and out. Uh, my mic's been acting a little weird. Also, you guys that are fans of film, uh, my movie review channel, Is It Still Good, is starting to move a little bit. Some of the numbers are starting to move over, over there, so... I've been splitting my time between making videos for 5 Minute Knives and videos for that channel. I've been looking to team up. There was a guy who made holsters at the show I was at in Tulsa. It was the biggest gun and knife show in the world. And he was going to do a giveaway with the channel here, but I haven't heard back from him. So let me reach out to him. I think he was going to donate like a G19 holster or something for you guys. So we'll see about that. No promises there. Uh, shout out to the last vendor next to me who I got these beads from. At the last event, I'm wearing Johnny Six, my Casio G-Shock with the AliExpress $2 bands that work just fine. So that's what I got on today for Toyki Day. Super excited. So let me know below if you guys have anything to donate to my buddy. If not, no big deal. I just figured I'd give him this. It was laying around. Make a quick video. Say hi to you guys. Thank you once again to Josh Fields for donating this. I am paying it forward. Other than that, you guys have been amazing. It's been a hell of a year so far. And we will see you next time on 5 Minute Knives.